Hi children, we meet again. How are you today? Let's uh, continue our lesson. Our topic today is uh, convert units of time. But this time, maybe it's going to involve decimals. Okay? Now, let's see a few examples. Okay, the first example, 4.5 hours convert to minutes. As you learned before, okay, to convert hour to minutes, you have to multiply with 60. So, 4.5 multiply with 60. You can just perform the normal multiplication that involving decimal. Okay, you will get 270 minutes. Okay, there's also another method to do this. Okay, what you can do is 4.5 hours, you split them to 4 hours and 0 0.5 hours. Okay, then you multiply with 60. 4 times 60, you will have 240 minutes. 0 0.5 times 60, you will have 30 minutes. Okay, when you add them, you will get 270 minutes. See another example. Convert 0.25 day to hours. Okay. Again, one day is equals to 24 hours. To convert day to hours, you multiply with 24. So 0 0.25 multiply with 24. You perform the normal uh, multiplication that involving decimal. You will get six hours okay you can remove the zeros okay now okay another method is 0 0.25 day you convert to fraction okay look at this diagram how to convert to fraction okay 0 0.25 it will be equal to 25 over 100 then when you simplify the fraction 25 over 100 you will get 1 over 4 day 1 over 4 multiplied with 24, you will get 6 hours. Let's move on to another example. Okay, now we'll see how to convert year to month. Okay, 1 year is equal to 12 months. Okay, we have 29.5 years convert to months. What you can do is 29.5, you multiply with 12. Okay, multiply as usual. Okay, use the standard method. And you will get the answer, 354 months. Okay. Now, you can also do this by splitting them. Okay, split. 29.5 years, okay, separate split or separate them to 29 years plus with 0 0.5 years, okay? 29 years, you convert to months, you multiply with 12, you will get 348 and 0 0.5 years is equals to half a year. So, half a year will be 6 months. So, 348 months plus with 6 years, you will get 354 months. See another example, you have 1.3 decades convert to year. Okay, 1 decade equals to 10 years. So when you want to convert, you have to multiply with 10. So 1.3 multiply with 10, okay, you will get 13 years. 0 0.67 century convert to years. Okay, 1 century equals to 100 years. Okay, again, if you want to convert, you multiply with 100. So, 0 0.67 multiply with 100, you will get 67 years. Okay, children, uh, that's all for today. See you again. Bye.